गुड मॉर्निंग फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी विल सी ए लाइव डेमोस्ट्रेशन ऑफ चेस्ट ट्यूब ड्रेनेज और इंटरकोस्टल ट्यूब ड्रेनेज इन ए प्लूरल कैविटी दिस इज सिंपल एंड लाइफ सेविंग प्रोसीजर सो बिफोर एनी सर्जिकल इंटरवेंशन दिस इज नेसेसरी टू टेक रिटर्न कंसेंट फ्रॉम पेशेंट इन कंसेंट वी हैव टू एक्सप्लेन अबाउट मेथड ऑफ प्रोसीजर इट्स इंडिकेशन कॉन्टा इंडिकेशन कॉम्प्लिकेशन एंड एनी अदर थिंग्स विच इज रिलेटेड टू दिस प्रोसीजर कॉम्प्लिकेशंस आर नॉट मच माइनर कॉम्प्लिकेशंस लाइक पेन एट आई सी डी साइट एक्सेसिव ब्लीडिंग सर्जिकल इम्फाइसीमा और समटाइम वेसो वेगल शॉक इफ यू नॉट गिव एडिक्यूट एनालजेसिया द साइट ऑफ प्रोसीजर वी कैन मार्क बाई टू मेथड वन इज ट्राइंगल ऑफ सेफ वट इज ट्राइंगल ऑफ सेफ दिस इज इमेजनरी ट्राइंगल विच इज फॉर्म्ड बाई अपेक्स बाई एक्जला वन आर्म बाई एंटी एक्जलरी लाइन विच इज फॉर्म बाई पेक्ट्रोलिस मेजर मसल पोस्टीरियर आर्म बाई पोस्ट एक्जलरी लाइन फॉर्म बाई लेटस मेड डॉट साई एंड बेस ए इमेजनरी लाइन विच क्रॉस बाई निपिल्स इन मेल एंड फिफ्थ फिफ्थ इंटरकोस्टल स्पेस इन फीमेल तो दिस इज ट्राइंगल ऑफ सेफ और सेफ ट्राइंगल इन दिस ट्राइंगल देर इज नो ब्लड वेसल्स सो दिस इज सेफ टू डू प्रोसीजर इन दिस ट्राइंगल ओनली अनदर मेथड इज बाई अल्ट्रासाउंड बाई अल्ट्रासाउंड वी हैव टू लोकलाइज मैक्सिमम फ्लूड कलेक्शन और मैक्सिमम कलेक्शन विच इज फ्री ऑफ लोकुलेशन तो वी मार्क दैट साइट एंड दैट इज द आइडियल साइट ऑफ चेस्ट ट्यूब ड्रेनेस नाउ लेट सी लाइफ डेमोस्ट्रेशन ऑफ चेस्ट ट्यूब इन ए पेशेंट दिस इज द एक्सरे ऑफ पेशेंट इन विच वी आर गोइंग टू इंसर्ट चेस्ट ट्यूब दिस इज थर्टी सिक्स ईयर ओल्ड फीमेल हु हैज सिम्टम्स ऑफ वन ईयर यू कैन सी इन दिस एक्सरे देयर इज प्यूरल फ्लूड कलेक्शन on left side and there is mediastinal shift on same side in right side you can see compensatory emphysema it means patient has long standing disease in which pleural fibrosis also developed we will see in ultrasound and mark the site where we are going to insert chest tube first we will examine pleural cavity by ultrasound in ultrasound you can see there is opacity pus collection it has glandular appearance which is suggestive of pus and we will mark the site and confirm again by ultrasound in ultrasound you can see and down side this is c shaped which is diaphragm above diaphragm there is collection then we will clean our site with betadine sterlium and before inserting a needle we will check again by ultrasound and confirm our insertion site we will give local anesthesia by 1% jalocaine mixed with adrenaline first we will infiltrate skin because it is very pain sensitive area then we will go mm by mm down and we will give local anesthesia we will anesthetize pleura and rib also because it is very painful area after inserting pleura we will suck and you can see it is air as our case was pyonemothorax without confirming pus or air we should not put chest tube and by the time local will take action we will see chest tube so this is 24 french chest tube and it has four or five holes after that is marking 2 4 6 8 this is centimeter and this is end blind end so we will cut two holes and this is blind area 3 french equals to 1 mm so 24 french means 
8 mm it has outer diameter of chest tube so we will give incision of around 1.5 cm is only skin and subcutaneous incision then we will dissect by artery forcep fat muscles and we will go up to pleura and we should remember that while going inside we have to close artery forcep and while coming we have to come by open then we are reached pleura we will puncture the pleura by artery forceps and dilate it by another artery forcep we will insert chest tube and we will remove artery forcep after that we will clamp it so pus should not come very fast then we will connect to icd bag by this connector then we will open it and we will check our chest tube patency now you can see there is column movement on respiration so our chest tube is patent we can see pus coming out and going inside with respiration then we will fix chest tube according to built of patient in this we will fix at 8 cm yes 8 cm then we will put sutures here we will put two sutures one anterior side one posterior side so this is anterior side and we will fix chest tube with this suture so icd will not come out yeah we will tight knot on chest tube same thing we will do on posterior side also so by both side we will tie chest tube with sutures so it will fix tightly chest tube so it will not remove accidentally many persons put suture differently somebody puts purse slip suture somebody puts another suture so there is no added advantage one suture to another suture yeah so you can see we are tying knot to chest tube then we will take gauze piece with vitadin and put it on chest tube now we have to cover with bandage so there is no need to put large bandage small bandage will do better so you can see small bandage we are pasting it we are taking another bandage which we have cut on two ends so we can stick chest tube with this bandage yeah we have to stick same bandage opposite side and we will stick chest tube now we will confirm our chest tube patency you can see there is pus in chest tube now our procedure completed now we will get accident to check chest tube position so friends this is safe and simple procedure if you like this video please share with your friends write comment in comment box please like it and you if you have not subscribed this channel please subscribe it meet you soon with a new video thank you thank you very much